How do you feel about sharing your works in progress with the public? Um, I'm going to always continue to push and, and work hard towards, but really ultimately I think, I think what resonates with people is that I've always tried to remain true and honest. Uh, and so I have, I believe in sharing my sketches, even in my process, um, even drawings that I know aren't very good. I've, had, I've been criticized by some fairly well-known artists for doing that. They think that I should only show the best work that I've ever done. And I disagree because I'm human. And I feel like if people can see, if they look up to me and they see me doing covers and so on for magazines, and they see that, you know, even I do bad drawings and paintings from now and down then, and I do, that I'm human. And hopefully that encourages them to work hard and to become better. Um, and I hope that it does. I, there's no tricks or anything. There's, I'm not afraid to give away what I know. Um, I don't think that it's going to take away from, from my success or, you know, I, I, it's, it's just hard work. Um, there's no tricks. I draw and I paint. Um, you know, so anybody can do it really. And I, I believe that uh, it's, it's really, it comes down to just having a strong passion working hard and being honest and, you know, really loving and caring for other people. Um, and I think that relationship that I've tried to, to have with people and fans um, has really uh, been a, a good thing for everybody. Um, I basically answer every single email I get, every Facebook email, every Instagram, every Twitter, um, as much of them as possible, and I really feel it's important. Um, you know, it, it only takes a few minutes a day to, to reply to some, some people, and um, I really think um, that and hard work. Um, as far as magazines go, how did I become successful with magazine work? Um, again, it's, it's perseverance, um, hard work, um, and, you know, really believing in, in what you're doing. I mean, I... Um, I booked my own flights to New York. I set up my own appointments uh, for the most part. Some of them were through my agent. And I would go to New York and I would show them my portfolio. And almost every time I'd walk away with work. If I didn't get work, I would uh, have just real positive uh, feedback. And eventually down the line, I would get work from them. Um, so it, it's really just a belief, you know, believing in yourself, hard work, and, you know, just really a love for what you're doing. And uh, I hope that answers that question. Thanks for watching another Mad Artist interview. See the full interview at thecompleteartistbook.com. Buy the video workshop and learn from the top industry professionals today. For more interviews and video workshops, visit madartistpublishing.com. It's time to get on the map.